I think that multi-trade prefabrication is one of the best opportunities for us to gain efficiency and productivity in our industry. Labor and uh, productivity is optimized through prefab by having a controlled environment able to uh, you know, sequence work properly, uh, trades are, have their time on a rack and are able to, to install at their will. We are working 30 inches off the ground. There is no ladder use, there is no uh, kneeling, there is no required uh, um, tie-offs. Safety has been completely improved. Quality-wise, you're at working between three feet and about five feet, so you don't have to get on a ladder. The guys are able to get around without having to be on a ladder in between on a 10-foot ladder, so they have the ability to inspect their work and not have to go up, down, up, down. So with the quality control, once all the piping, ductwork, conduit, cable track is installed, we then go through and we inspect all the ductwork. We cap the ends of the pipe on both ends, shut all the ball valves, uh, and then we set up a test rig, and then we test it to the proper pressure for the specs. When we're looking at a safe work environment, the guy's time needs to be limited on ladders and scaffolds, and the prefabrication process allows them to do the work at chest level in a controlled environment to limit the amount of hazards that they're going to be exposed to. So on this schedule, the original project schedule and based on our history of doing many of these similar projects would have been about a 39 month schedule for a facility about 540,000 square feet. Uh, this schedule is going to be closer to 35. Probably two months of the schedule reduction is due to the prefabricated racks really eliminating the amount of time uh, that we have to wait in the field for the overhead to get complete before we can start with the wall roughing and all the subsequent activities. The real benefit comes in monetarily is that the owner um, opens the facility that much quicker. It can reduce the financing costs, which in this case are millions of dollars a month, as well as bring in revenue to the project sooner, which in this case is about $1.5 million per month. Per month. So for the two month schedule reduction, the owner will probably see a benefit of about six to seven million dollars. So from a planning perspective, with the challenge of lowering capital costs, we realize that we need to fundamentally change uh, the way we deliver projects. After studying, I don't know, 12 or 13 different elements on ways to reduce capital costs, prefabrication um, to me multi-trade prefab modularization is going to be the way we fundamentally change our industry. I mean, that's, that's the thing we have. And it's just a matter of time and, and uh, adoption in the industry. And it's going to happen, and it's happening now.